Welcome to lecture number 15 of the series Unreal 5 for Arquis and in today's lecture we'll model a few questions for this pad so let's get started first of all let me select this mesh I'll go into the sculpting tab and let's make a few changes because I don't like this irregular sort of shape I'll hold shift on my keyboard and let's drag my mouse like this I think this looks much better let's change the deformation type to expand and let's clear this artifact okay let's go back into the layout tab and let's add a cube we'll scale this on y axis Let's move this cube and I'll place it over my bed. Let's scale this on Z. Yeah. We'll go into the side view. Let's rotate this just a little bit on X axis. I'll scale this down on local Y axis. yeah okay we'll go into the edit mode and I'll add a few loop cuts let's add subdivision surface modifier I'll switch this to simple and let's increase the level to 2 I'll go into my physics properties and let's add claw simulation let's move to frame number one and let's increase the quality steps to 10 vertex mass to 0 0.01 and I'll enable my pressure and increase my pressure to 1 I need the collision's quality of 5 and let's decrease this distance to minimum possible value Okay, I don't need self collisions for this simulation, so let's run our simulation. Okay, let me jump back to frame number one. I think one is too low for this one. Let's type in 2.5. Yeah, I think this shape looks perfect so yeah I'll select this one let's go back into the frame number one let's go into the top view I'll create a copy on x-axis and I'll move both of these on X okay let's run the simulation again Yeah, I think they look good. Yeah, this shape is perfect. So I'll select this one. I'll create a copy on Y axis. Okay, I'll select both of these and let's apply the simulation. I'll apply shade smooth and I'll add a subdivision surface. okay let's select this mesh let's go back into the frame number one let's find a perfect spot for this cushion I think this is fine yeah okay I'll select both of these and let's add collisions okay let's run the simulation Yes, uh, I think they look perfect. I think frame number 13 is perfect for this shape. Yeah, I think that came out pretty well. So 
let me select this mesh and I'll apply all my modifiers let's apply shade smooth and I'll add a subdivision surface modifier let's select all of these I'll go into the edit mode let's go into the edge selection mode and I'll select these edges and I'll press Alt S on my keyboard and bring these edges down let's bring down these edges just a little bit okay yeah just to create a seam line in between them now you can always go into the sculpting mode and add a few more wrinkles but I think the claw simulation has done a pretty good job at this point so I don't need to sculpt and add more wrinkles okay yeah okay so I think that's it for this lecture in the next lecture we'll model a few curtains for our bedroom okay let's unhide everything yeah okay so I'll see you guys in the next lecture